Let's go into the second big trend that we want to talk about here, with Brett, and that's there. Yeah, we've touched on it, but what about inflation? What about recession? What does that look like for, for us going into If you're in business or you're about in anything right. right now, obviously there's a lot of talk about inflation and the impact of inflation. And are we, you know, I'm not an economist. Well, Tim, neither one of us are economists, but um, so, you know, not going to get into the argument whether we're, you know, in a recession or we're not, but we definitely have inflation. And, you know, inflation, you know, it's always nice to define what what something is. And so, you know, inflation is the sustained increase in the price of goods and services that are available in the economy. So, you know, the main driver of inflation is the supply and demand for those goods and services. So if you think about COVID, you know, we, we shut everything down. We created huge supply issues that we're continuing to still try to dig out of, Tim, you know, in our space that we are in and in, in primarily in the manufacturing, every manufacturing facility that we're in has been running hard, you know, trying to to catch up, you know, to the to the demand of, of the supply. Well what happens in that, so then naturally, you know, those costs start going up, you know, based off of higher demand. And so now as that happens, your inflation costs go up and, and it starts to cost you more money than to, you know, to run your business, um, which, you know, you can go a variety of ways with this whole inflation conversation in that I think as our audience, as, as people who are running businesses, the places where you see the impact, if, if your costs are going up to run the business, then you've got to either cut cost you know, or you have to become more efficient or increase productivity or both. Or so pass it on to your customers or and increase prices and, exactly. you know, and at your own peril. Right? Yep. Well and that's and that becomes that balancing and that's that's what we're seeing right now and I think that's what we're we're all gonna continue to manage. Um, you know, I always used to have a a saying when when I uh, when I owned the manufacturing company and was in that, that world is I always had some really good accountants around me, um, but often I would have to remind them, you know, we're not gonna, we're not gonna save our way to a profit. You know, you know, we've got to be cost conscious, but we've got to continue to push forward, or we're just, you know, we're just dying a slow death.